Okay, cool, man. Well, this is what I was gonna do. Hey, hey, hey. What the hell with that, man? This is something that, that blends in with what he was just saying and uh, also what Chris was just singing a little while ago. And it's called fascism? Huh? That's what it's called. We will lay, we will laugh in the face of bombardment by external forces we can't control. You can whip and strap me down, gag me, but my soul will grin the spectrum, man. Nothing can cut the electric current of creation thought epiphany. I am not a free individual, nor will government conspiracy theories explain the pressure from government from government to oppose government. Sell me your wares, new and improved, specially treated, organically tougher breakthroughs. Meal tickets are usually very colorful, aesthetic makeovers of common shit, my friends. Step right up, herds, folks, for the pittance of one month's car payments for my snobberoo. 9,000 VO Turbo, I will slap the shit out of you with my hard painting cock and coerce you into the desire for a 16 inch, one in, no, that wasn't inch variation, no, a 16 in one, do almost anything poorly machine. My scurvy wanna make a, me, scurvy wanna make a buck. You, stupid waste of space and ozone layer mass commercial consumer, come to my houses, my slaughter fields. I'll make you not even know that you are a precious resource, creative intellect, creative intellect. Don't, under any circumstances, veer from the standard set. You wouldn't want to piss us off, would you? <laughs> yeah. This is called uh, Me and My Mother. It's real dirty. <laughs> and it's about me and Mother Nature. Okay, I see. Okay. Well, can I give you a sob story? Do you mind? Do you mind if I give you a sob story? Alright. Alright, here it goes. I was adopted. I was adopted at a very young age, so I never had a like, real maternal mother. I never got, well, suck a little nun tit in the orphanage I was in. But other than that, I'd never done anything. Never, never had like the real maternal sort of, you know, you know, I was raped, me and Roseanne Barr were raped at age like one year old, you know. But other than that, other than that, I, I'm fine. And so Mother Nature is like the one mother that I really connect with. And this is a poem about Mother Nature. Any of you that are offended by it, um, sorry. <laughs> Hello, mama. Big Mother Nature, I come home from the big city to see you. I miss you, mommy, and when I miss you, I'm gonna tear off all my clothes and stick my dick in your mud flats and then let you suck the rocket flanks of your streams. I'm gonna hump every stuff you got till I'm raw and your volcanic memories spew forth the molten earth milk lava I crave. Oh, mama, of everything fruitful, green, growing, don't smoke, hurt, and dying, I'm gonna tumble down your alluvial fans over roots grabbing up my ankles and fallen trunks scraping my limbs till your valley sternum at your bosom as your breath blows and plays the branches and leaves like muted wind chimes in your streams dance and laugh over the rocks fast asleep in their beds. Looking in on me, you will tuck me in with a blanket of mountain dew. And your cold and warm morning breeze will pinch my cheeks out of sleep. Good morning, Mom! I'm going down to your jagged sandy beaches. Good morning, my son. 
I will sandblast you and peel the top layer of city dermis off your hide so I can warm you in my frigid waters and rock you like I know you love to. <laughs> when you lie on my beach under the mist, scores of flies will be my mouth and eyes and will view compound kaleidoscope visions of your entire body as my tongues taste the sweetness of your pores. My heart star-shaped sun will heat your ecological sensibilities into flames of passion for your poor fucking mother who received nothing but pollution and disrobing of her foliage from the majority of your siblings. And in the night, I, Mother Nature, will nourish you with herbs, fish, that blow a melancholy tune through my trees, knowing that in the morning you will leave me with soil fertilizing excrement, that <coughs> excrement, and a swollen flowing tears from my gracious open roots. But, my son, remember, when you wake, that a deer is not a king, and that a dove is worth more alive than a dozen dead presidents. So just when I, I thought we were gonna go home, we're not. Diane, Diane. Are you out here? Where is she? Diane.